home of local Christian music. Amplify Podcast. Make loud his praise.
I'm Douglas here from Amplify Studios and welcome once again to another episode of Amplify Podcast, the home of local Christian music. And yes, one of our slogans is make loud his praise. And we here at Amplify Studios want to make his praise and his songs and his word as loud as we can so that many people, not just in Singapore, but around the world can hear his praise through these songs and be ministered and touched by his presence and love. And that is what Amplify Podcast is all about. It is to bless your souls and heart and bring His love to all you listeners. And we believe that God has given this land songs to bless our nation as well as the nations all around us too. So do help us to spread and share our podcast program around. And the first two songs you heard are called You Are Good by Clemensim as well as Everlasting Praise by Generations Worship. And Generations Worship are the youth worship band of Cornerstone Community Church. Hey, if you want to listen to more worship songs from Clemensim or Generations Worship or any other church worship or our local worship artists, 
you can check them all out on our music page. Just simply head down to our website, which is www.amplifystudiosg.com, and click on the music tab on our menu. And from there, you get to see all the artists and churches worship songs whom we have featured on our Amplify podcast. Until today, we have featured worship songs from a total of 35 churches and artists in Singapore. So do go and check them all out. And today we have more worship songs to bless you with. We have songs by Awakened Generations, City Worship, as well as Impact Live Worship to minister to you wherever you are and whatever you are going through. And also today on our Amplified Devo Originals, we'll be sharing on Jesus being our life. You know, if you ask yourself this question, what is life? Have you ever asked yourself that question? What is life to you? Is it about getting good grades, getting a good paying job, having a car or house, getting married, having kids, etc., etc.? Is life just about living each day, striving and slogging out, or is there more to this life? You know, God doesn't want us to live just to die. That was never His intention. But because of sin, we are living in this broken and fallen world where everything around us dies. But when God first made us, life never had an expiry date. So how can we get back this life? It is through Jesus. He came so that we may have life and have life more abundantly. So stay tuned to find out what kind of life does Jesus give to us as believers and be blessed. Alright, and also do follow us on our social media platforms too to keep up to date with our staff as well as to be ministered and blessed by our posts. We regularly share up verses, thoughts of the day as well as tips and encouraging staff to lift up your faith in God. So do follow us on Facebook and our Instagram page at amplifystudios.sg And do remember to like, share and save our posts too. And also, if you're on YouTube, you can also subscribe to our YouTube channel. We have all our Amplify Podcast episodes up on our channel. And also, our BTS, which is our Behind the Song interview videos, where we interview our local songwriters on how they wrote the songs and how God inspired them. So do check them all out and remember to click the like button, share and subscribe to us. Last but not the least, if you are on Spotify, you can also check out our latest playlist where we feature our favorite songs from each of the churches and artists' songs on our Amplify podcast. There's almost a total of 80 songs that spans through about 7 hours of worship songs to bless your ears and heart. So do follow the playlist which is called Best of Singapore Worship Music. Do follow us and share it around. And if you've been blessed by our podcast and want to support us in this ministry, then do go down to our website and click on the Partner With Us tab on our menu. You see, as our podcast is free for all to listen and we don't get a single cent from producing and releasing this podcast, your contribution towards this ministry will help us not only to keep Amplify Studios up and running, but it also helps us to continue to create more Christ-centered content on the digital media and to continue to put up our local worship songs on the media airwaves. And we pray that these podcasts will continue to advance the gospel of Christ and save those who hear them. So we want to thank you so much for all your support in this ministry. Alright, coming right up, we have the songs by Awakened Generation called Light Has Come as well as Glorious Mystery by CD Worship. And last but not the least, we have Impact Live Worship with the song Rescue. So stay safe, stay blessed and stay tuned to the best mix of local Christian music only on Amplify Podcast. Home of local Christian music, only on Amplified Podcast. Make loud his praise.
Devo, be refreshed, be renewed, be restored. Hi, Amplify listeners. In today's Amplify Devo, we'll be talking about Jesus is our life today. And the scripture reference can be taken from Colossians chapter three, verse four. When Christ, who is our life, appears. Then you also will appear with him in glory. What is life? This is a question where most of us will have asked ourselves at one point of time in life. If you do a survey and ask people around, many would say that life is about getting good grades, getting into a good school. Getting a good degree, getting a good job which pays well, owning a car or house, have a lovely family with wife and kids, or you could be doing good and loving others, being filial to our parents. And some might mention that life is about getting what you want and fulfilling your dreams and desires. Or to some, life might be just be getting through each day and surviving. And even some might say that life is about enjoyment. Nothing wrong with all these comments, but is life all about that? I remember asking one of my classmates this question, and his reply is that life is about living, and then dying, and then nothing. There's nothing more after death, meaning when we die, it is just. Black blank, a sense of deep darkness and emptiness after that for eternity. But thanks be to God, that is not true for us as believers. We know that when we receive Christ as our Savior, we will have eternal life with Him in heaven. And we all know that heaven is such a beautiful place, filled with glorious things. But how about life now on Earth? Shall we live a poor life so that we can live a good eternal life in heaven? Not at all. In fact, Christ came that we might have life and have life more abundantly, as mentioned in John ten ten. He came to give us abundant life, meaning you have access to the abundance in health, wholeness. Wealth, joy, strength, vitality, wisdom, enjoyment, peace, love, and many more. All we need to do is to take them in faith. 
When we follow Christ, we will have no lack because God will supply all our needs according to His riches in glory. Not just when we are in heaven, but on earth too. However, many Christians live with the lack mentality today, because they don't have the faith and belief to take them. They don't believe that Christ has given them all these things, or they feel that they have to work for them, or be good enough to get God's approval to earn it. Whereas Christ has already paid the price, so that you and I are entitled to it. In fact, Colossians 3 verse 4 says that Jesus is our life, and this life mentioned is called Zoe in Greek. Jesus is our Zoe life. What does Zoe mean? It means to have life that is real and genuine, a life that is active and vigorous, a life that is of God and is greatly blessed. The life of Christ is in you. Is youth and vitality part of it? Yes. The Bible says that we will have renewed youth when we partake His life into us. Whatever Jesus has or is, we have and are too because He lives in us. And what we receive in this life from God is only a portion of what we will receive when Christ comes back again for us. When we have this Zoe life, it entitles us to receive our perfect new body when Christ comes back again, as the Apostle Paul said in 1 Corinthians chapter 15, verse 50 to 54. We will have an incorruptible body that will never die or fall sick. No more ailments, headaches, sickness or diseases in us. Death is dead in our bodies and no longer reigns in us. We will never die. We will have a perfect body. This is eternal life. When Christ appears, we will also appear with Him in glory. And glory here in Greek is doxa, which means the glorious condition of blessedness which us as Christians will receive and fully enter into. In fact, even now, people can see a glimpse of God's glory in you through His blessings in you. As you receive Christ in your life, receive His life too in you. You have His Zoe life in you. Claim all that Christ is and has and see His glory appear in your life filled with His blessings. From these, people will be able to see Christ in you, the hope of glory. And His life that is in you will change you from the inside out. Addictions and all fleshly desires will all fade away at the glory of His life in you. You will shine forth in His glory because the life of Christ is in you.
to keep going on Yet so many times I can deny You're there all alone And I uh, 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 I know it for sure now That you to my rescue You're listening to the home of local Christian music Amplify Podcast Make loud his praise 